So tell me how's it feel Tell me how's it feel Sitting up there Feeling so high So tell me how's it feel Tell me how's it feel Sitting up there Feeling so high so Why? I, you know, I don't understand why there's a need for you to even mention your husband. This is something that you should have done for yourself. It has nothing to do with him. And I doubt very seriously that now he regrets leaving you. Why didn't you do this when you were with him? Is it because he didn't deserve it? Because you didn't deserve it? Or you just didn't care? But you get a divorce and all of a sudden now you're doing probably the very exact thing that he wanted you to do when you were married. You did this because you got a divorce, this is my opinion. You got a divorce and you want someone else. So now it's all because you want someone else that you lose weight and you look this way. And you have to make a video saying, see? My husband regrets it, and now all these other men want me. I have options. But just like you gain the weight the first time, you can gain the weight again. This should be a good lesson. Because I'm sure when your husband met you, you probably looked like this. And then you let yourself go. Because you thought that everything was good. And you could just be whoever it is you want to be and live in your truth, right? And for you guys that don't know, before you start making all these comments on this video, I've been in health and fitness for a very long time. I've helped women just like her, men too. I even helped myself lose a lot of weight through the help of others. So I'm not new to this. I know what the mentality is. When you do something like this, it has to be for you, not nobody else, not to make nobody else jealous, definitely not to make somebody regret not being with you no more. That has to come from you. But there seems to be always a need to throw men under the bus, and that's what irritates me about this video. I'm very proud that she lost weight and she looks great. That, that's a good thing. But why the need to throw the man under the bus and say, well, hey, now he regrets it. This guy has probably moved on just like you've moved on. Focus on you and stop trying to throw men under the bus. You don't need to throw men under the bus to make your point, to be proud of what you did for yourself.